Hi guys, Miss Ruth here. I'm glad you've joined me again today. We're going to look at another one of the parables Jesus told. This parable is found in Matthew chapter 25, verses 1 through 13, and it's called the parable of the 10 bridesmaids. So, are you ready? You might be thinking, ready for what? Well, ready for anything. It's important to be prepared for whatever life might throw our way, right? Right. Have you ever waited a long time for something you really wanted to happen? Have you waited for your birthday or summer vacation? Did you count the days until the excitement begins? Do you plan and dream what it's going to be like? You know, Jesus told a parable about being ready for anything. In this parable, Jesus was telling us about 10 young women who were waiting for a very special wedding. They had to wait a long time. They waited so long that they sat down and tried to get comfortable. They knew that the wedding party was supposed to pass their way, and they wanted to join the group and walk with the other guests to the wedding. But none of them had expected that it would be such a long wait. Five of the women were wise and thought it would be a good idea to take along some extra oil for their lamps, since they really didn't know when the wedding would begin. But the other five were foolish, and they probably thought it won't be that long before the wedding begins. So they didn't put any extra oil in their containers that everyone carried at night. Their lamps were full when they left home. They were sure they would have enough. So five of the women took extra oil and five of them didn't. It was getting late and there was no sign of the bridegroom. The women waited so long that they fell asleep. Suddenly at midnight, they were awakened by a loud, happy shout. Wake up, wake up, the bridegroom is here. The 10 bridesmaids quickly stood up and prepared their lamps. The five women who had extra oil quickly used it all to fill their lamps to make them very bright. But the five who didn't bring extra oil worried that their lamps were too dim. So they asked the other five women if they would share their oil. But the five bridesmaids who had extra oil didn't have any extra oil to share. So they told the five who didn't bring extra oil to go to the store to buy oil for themselves. Well, it wouldn't be easy to find an open store at midnight, but the five bridesmaids headed out into the night anyway. While they were gone, the groom arrived and the wedding procession began. And everyone who was ready and waiting went into the party and began to celebrate. By the time the five bridesmaids returned from the store with fresh oil, it was too late. The door to the wedding hall was closed and locked and there was no way they could get inside. After all that waiting, they missed the wedding because they were not prepared. The bridegroom himself came to the door and said, I'm sorry, but I don't know you. He turned around and closed the door. In this parable, Jesus is the bridegroom and we are the bridesmaids. Like the five wise young women waiting for the bridegroom, we must be ready when Jesus comes again. We stay ready by making good choices every day, by studying the Bible, by praying, and choosing to be best friends with Jesus. And when Jesus comes again, we will be ready. Let us pray. Dear Jesus, one day we'll get to meet you face to face. Help us to be ready for that wonderful day. Amen. Thanks for joining me, guys. Don't forget to click on the subscribe button so that you can see other messages. 
and click the notification buttons so that you can be notified when new children's messages are available. It's been fun as always. Until next time, smooches. <laughs>